Okay, so here's a quick story for you. A woman in Vietnam claims to be surviving on water alone for the past 41 years. 41 years. I saw the story and I'm like, my first question was, why? Like, like, why, why did you even think about doing this? Why, why, why just, just why? And it, it's, it's, you know, people do what they want. People do what they want and they make the choices that they want to make. So, you know, why, why, why wouldn't you do this is the question she might probably ask me. So she, like I said, she's from Vin Vietnam. She's 63 years old. Miss Ngong, probably saying that wrong. For the past 41 years, she's allegedly been li living off water with a few grams of salt and sugar so she's just she's just drinking water and like sprinkle a little salt in there or just sprinkle a little sugar in there and some sometimes some lemon juice some lemon juice just to you know you know spice it up spice it up and she is she is as you would expect not healthy okay she is she is not healthy this is this isn't something that you do i don't think this is something that makes any sense at all Okay, I'm not a nutritionist. I mean, I'm not a medical professional, but this doesn't, you know, this doesn't sound like a good idea. She also does yoga. I don't know where she finds the strength to do yoga because she ain't eating anything. She says that she doesn't eat any solid food. She doesn't eat any solid food at all because she considers water to be very vital to her health. Water is very vital to her. It's more important than anything else. And she's just like, hey, yo, I'm just going to drink this water. I'm just put some salt in it because my salt need, need them electrolytes. Put a little sugar in it because my, my body, you know, it needs the energy from the sugar mitochondria to just pump that energy all around my body. Okay, I did a little bit of science. Okay, I did a little bit of biology, a little bit of chemistry, you know what I'm saying? I know I know a little bit about how, how the body works, the mitochondria, you know what I'm saying? And she's just, she's just like, yo, listen, okay, listen. I've been surviving 41 years off this. I did it for one week. It worked. There ain't nothing wrong. I'm just going to continue doing it. Just going to continue doing it. It's if my body, my temple. I'm gonna do what I want. I'm gonna put what I want in it. Or I'm gonna put what I don't want in it out of it. You know what I'm saying? It doesn't make sense, but I, I'm gonna do it. And as you can tell, it it comes with a lot of issues. Like, for instance, she 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 gets. That's the lady, by the way. She gets daily stomach aches very very bad stomach aches according to her i'm guessing she's just pooping out air at some point because ain't ain't no food in her for her body to like break down and and you know take out she ain't she ain't she ain't she ain't she ain't healthy is all i take from this and i ain't, I ain't here to criticize people's lifestyle even though that's what it sounds like i'm kind of doing sort of in a way but I don't I don't think this is a good idea. I don't think that this is a good idea. I don't think you should be surviving off of water and sugar with some salt in it like you're drinking bootleg Gatorade doing um yoga. Where are you finding the yoga? I don't know. I don't know where you're finding the strength to do yoga from the the sugar that you're eating. Maybe she is not telling us something. Maybe there is something else that she, she ain't telling us. She isn't even thinking about, you know, promoting her lifestyle to other people. And I'm I'm just gonna stay. I'm not with it. I'm not with it. Would would y'all do it? Would y'all just throw away all the McDonald's? You know what I'm saying? The Burger King, whatever foot fast food or food that you like to cook, chicken, you know, beef, curry. I'm a big curry fan. Okay, but especially Indian. Curry. You know how good Indian curry is, bro. T to not eat that anymore, it's it's just it's just I can't I can't. I can't, it doesn't matter how healthy I will be. Just exercise and work out. You know, do some running, do some jogs, drink some water. You, you'll be fine. You, you'll be fine. Granted, as you get older, you're going to have to cut down on a lot of the things that you eat that are not good for you, right? You're going to have to cut down on it. But exercise, you know, daily workouts, jogging, do a little, some stretches, do some yoga, you know, get the body, get the body going, blood flowing, get the blood pumping, all of that. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. Don't, don't go to the extremes of just drinking water with some sugar and some salt, like bootleg Gatorade or bootleg Powerade. You know what I'm saying? Just, just to be like on this fitness thing. I don't, I don't get it. But like I said, you know, it's her life. Live it how you want to live it. It's your choice. You know, y'all are grown ass, grown ass adults, grown adults, you know, 41 years of this and she, she is still alive and kicking, feeling better than she has ever been felt before. Good for her. Good. For, good. I'm happy for her.
I'm happy for her. For me, it's just not for me. Okay, I don't like water as it is. I have to force myself to drink water. I have like one of these water bottles that is like a hundred milliliters. I just realized that it was a hundred milliliters the other day. When I calculated how much of this I drank, I drank like three or four of these a day, which I probably not a lot of water considering some people are drinking like three of those massive jugs a day but those people are people that are working out and or like active i ain't active. i'm just teaching i'm really active and i just need like a good amount of water some good food and cook sometimes cooking helps cooking helps a lot helps you save money and also helps with your health because you know what you're putting in the food anyways where am i going with this again oh yeah live your life live your best life sounds like she's living her best life if y'all want to join her and live your best life as well go ahead go right ahead for me i'm just gonna continue eating good food and not putting on any weight because my metabolism is is kicking right now it's it's kicking and i'm taking advantage of it